I'm Professor Prajwal Shastri, an astrophysicist from Bengaluru in India. And it is my pleasure to introduce and interview Dr. Vani Varadhan Chatterjee, physicist at the Indian Institute of Science. Hello. Uh, so Vani, uh, you know while we're all excited about this total lunar eclipse which will happen on the 31st of January, what I'm surprised is that even scientists and engineers are hesitating to enjoy the beautiful copper moon and are being swayed by all the scaremongering. I remember that you had watched a total lunar eclipse almost 30 years ago and you were expecting your first child. You had an interesting experience. Do tell us about it. See, this eclipse occurred on February 28th in the year 1989. I was expecting my first child. He was born three months later. And various people, including my landlady, a very nice person, came and told me not to go out at all during the eclipse. Their concern was that I should not harm myself. Now all this created a lot of curiosity. I went to my gynecologist and asked her what I should do. So she told me, see as far as I know, nothing can happen. But then why do you want to take a chance? Why risk yourself? That's it. So wait, uh, I can see that your husband wants to say something. He's signaling. Yes, when I heard it from the gynecologist, I approached my family physician who is a friend and he said, I will try to find out from where all these myths originate. So next day, that is the previous evening to the, to the eclipse, he came to a place and he said, look, I have consulted five well-known gynecologists of the city and all of them have, have said, why do you want to take a risk? And then he joked with us that tomorrow I'll come and watch the eclipse with you because tomorrow night I know patients won't come to my clinic since it's the eclipse and it was a fairly late eclipse because it began at 7.30 and ended or 8.30 and ended at 9.30 or so so after his clinic hours he came over and we enjoyed the eclipse together. So Vani did you change your eating schedule? No we did not. We stuck to a much regular schedule. So what is this child up to now? This child was born three months later in the month of May 1989. A perfectly normal one. He chose to study law. He did his bachelor's in the National Law School at Gujarat. Then he worked in Bengaluru for some time. And then he went on to do his master's in law at the University of California at Berkeley. Actually, you can see a photograph of him here. Oh, great. Thank you, Vani.